A cat! Hello. Hello, Miss Migos, and welcome back to my channel. We are cat fam. Taco. I hope you're doing great. I hope you're having an amazing day. Just to finish my intro. <laughs> Everyone, meet Chili. You want to say hello? <laughs> Purr. Taco. <laughs> Do you think they're able to hear him? Before? I don't know, man. Anyway, today we are in the kitchen to... Um, what are we even doing? Oh, guys, by the way, look at my sweater. It's Thresh. No, it's amazing. <laughs> Go shop now at unprofessional.com. Hashtag Werbung. Hashtag everything is sold out, but you can still shop. I'm not wearing earrings. Ew, gross. Okay, now that I've covered everything, we can finally come to this video's topic. Food! Hey! And by that, we don't mean our cats. I mean, I, just, I mean, because their names not be good way. Ah! <laughs> I'm your audience, even though I'm on camera. <laughs> yes! This video is all about food. So, a couple of weeks ago, I was on the internet, and I found some interesting kitchen gadgets that I wanted to try out and here we are. We're gonna try out two kitchen... two. <laughs> two kitchen gadgets today. Numero uno is for when you're really hungry, which we are right now. Are you really hungry? Just say yes. Mm -hmm. I got this amazing quesadilla maker. So the first thing we're gonna do is quesadilla. I've always wanted to eat the quesadillas and then I ate them a couple of months ago in a restaurant and the restaurant wasn't really, I don't know, it kind of was boring. So I'm excited to put some more interesting stuff or a little bit more interesting. It's not gonna be like the most amazing thing you've ever seen in your entire life probably, but <laughs> a little more interesting than what I've eaten in the restaurant. So I'm excited to try out amazing case oh, quesadillas and I hope this is gonna be an amazing quesadilla maker. That's numero uno. In numero dos, because we all know after you've had your dinner, you just want to snack something. And ladies and gentlemen, snacks can be healthy, but the healthy snacks never taste good. Okay, they sometimes do. I don't mind being healthy. Just go with it. Guys, I got you. I actually hope I got you anyway. I've got this healthy potato chips maker? Chip maker. Slicer and microwave chip maker. Food. Which I'm excited to try out, especially if it's gonna be healthy. I'm just really afraid. I don't know if I've ever told you that, but I don't like potatoes. So if this, sorry. Cuddle session. Cuddle session. Cuddle. Anyway, I'm afraid that these chips, if they work at all, because let's be honest, we're making them in a microwave and this little thingy bingy. I'm afraid that they're gonna taste really potato-y, but maybe they're gonna be amazing. Well, I'm wondering if it's like uh, hard to make. I don't know, it looks easy. It says, slice microwave serve. Okay, that sounds easy. <laughs> <laughs> but let's start with the quesadilla first, okay? Yeah. Shall we? I'm because hungry. So luckily, this amazing quesadilla make... Okay, let's not say amazing yet, because... You've got something to prove, buddy. Either way, it came with food fiesta recipes. <laughs> I chose the vegetarian quesadillas, but it also has a really interesting recipe in here, which I'm nervous and excited to... Hey! Let's start with the first one. For that, we obviously need tortillas. This is great quality. <laughs> then we need 25 grams of corn, but we're, we don't care about the measurements today. <laughs> We're supposed to have black beans, but these are not black beans. Rinsed and well drained. Water is still in there. <laughs> we also need one tablespoon of diced red onion, and now we made the entire onion, so apparently this is gonna be an onion quesadilla. Oh, a dash of chili powder. We don't have chili powder. And then obviously we need cheese. I actually didn't know what cheese to use, and I knew that Naomi li really likes cheddar, so I bought that for her. Oh, they can't see me smiling. No. <laughs> so let's 
get this party started. Why the hell? Oh, let me clap. <laughs> boom, boom, clap, the boom, the clap, the clap, boom, yeah, boom, do clap. That. Just do that. Clap, clap, clap. We've got oil, which Naomi got from Paris for me, which has this little spray thingy, bingy. And then we've got some seasoning for Schwein. The instructions tell me to drizzle a little bit of oil on there, so that's what we're gonna do. Or not. <laughs> Taco, I'm sorry. You, you've got to go. I know oh, you're no. really sweet. He wants to put it. Yeah, but I've got this hot gadget. Now let's plug this bad boy in and wait for it to be hot. While we wait, you can tell me. Ooh, while we wait, a great EP by Kelani. <laughs> you want to tell me what you're grateful most in life for today? That was so not grammatically correct. I'm grateful for my two cookies. Cute. What are you most grateful for in life right now? Tell me. In the comment section down below. Maybe you should think of a new question. I like this question. It's amazing, but sometimes you need to switch it up a little bit. Why are you happy today? <laughs> Why are onions red? Why is the machine blue? Which machine? The blue machine. What cheese do I, do I use? Do I use Gouda? Is Gouda an English word? Gouda? Gouda! Good day, mate. <laughs> the mild yellow cheese originating from the Netherlands made from cow's milk. So I'll just put this wild white cheese... Mild, the, wild. Mild white cheese originated from the Netherlands made from cow milk in there. They're gonna know exactly what you mean. Yeah. Tijeras, por favor. Let's start the process. Whoa! We've got the tortilla here, and we'll just place it here. Oh, it's a little bit too big. Does that matter? Nah. Nah, we good. Yeah, we good. So now we basically just put all the ingredients on top and close it. <laughs> mm. Oh, she's so strong. Do you think that's enough? Yup. Okay, so now we need cheese. I am here with the mild white cheese originated in the Netherlands made from cow's milk. And I'm here with cheddar. <laughs> <laughs> They'll probably scream at our cheese choice. That looks like a tummy ache. Now we need our Schweinegewürz for some flavor flav. The cheese is already melting, so I think we should put the other one on top. Now that this way too big tortilla is on there, we can close this bad boy. Well, this is a bit of an issue. Ah! ah yay! Hello. <laughs> that just looks very good. It's smoking. Oh, the cheese is coming out. Yes. That doesn't sound good. Ugh, oh no, the cheese. Oh, the cheese. Oh my God, oh my God. Oh my God. Thank God I like it cheesy. You don't. Mm. <laughs> but do you like the sound of it? This is ASMR. Is this ASMR? Kind of. This is a bonfire. A cheese bonfire. No, just cheese the normal fire. bonfire. With cheese. Because it kind of sounds like bonfire. Yeah, and then you add the cheese. Close your eyes. Let your imagination flow. No, you ruined it. Is this done? Yeah. <gasps> Whoa! That looks perfect. I broke it. <laughs> Did you? Oh. Wow, this looks amazing. That looks so good. <laughs> Let's do the put the other one into the maker, and then while this uh, while the other one cooks, we're gonna taste the first one. This looks amazing. The other one is actually really crazy. What we need for this, and this is like so crazy. We need tortilla. Woo! Yeah. Maybe we're just gonna be like that, you know? Oh, oh. Hey, this is actually working. You wanna know the two ingredients that we need now? Brie. We need dried cranberries. <laughs> Honestly, that's gonna taste amazing, probably. Yeah? Cheese uh, with like berries in general will taste amazing. I think that's so crazy. I don't know, man, let's just try it out. So we're gonna cut this brie. How do you pronounce it in French? Brie. Cut my brie into pieces. 
This is my last quesadilla. Oh. Now some cranberries on top. Two more. Okay. One, two. And put this on top. Okay. Sedia. So Vincent broke the thing and now he has to hold it like this. I just really want to clean right now. That's all I can think about. One, two, three. Hello. Ow. Okay, let's try. I'm excited. Buen provecho. Buen provecho. Cheers. Cheers. Yum. <laughs> this is so easy to make though. Mm -hmm. And you can literally put anything in there. I also love how I talked about healthy chips in the beginning and then we made this. Next one. Oh well. Mm. Why are you looking at me? Because it's weird. It's fine though. I like the other one better, but this one almost tastes like cake. I mean, you could make cake with this. You just put Nutella in there and call mm, it a day. Should we do that? Peanut butter. Mm, should we do that? <laughs> Ooh, cool. Now this. Bye, beach. Ew, that looks bad actually. So now that this looks amazing, let's taste test. I mean, tastes it's, like bright wind Nutella. I mean, it tastes good. But not mind blowing. Please hold during this commercial break while we prepare everything for the second gadget. Okay, guys, I'm full. Me too. <laughs> Time to eat some chips. Sorry, I'm, I don't want to move anymore. This video is with me now. Should have filmed the process of opening this fish because this was a fish to open. Yeah, same. Okay, so we've got this thingy here. So this is our protagonist right now. So we've got this thingy. Then we've got this super sharp knife here to cut the onions, I want to say. <laughs> me too. Potatoes. Then they all go in here. And then we put this in the microwave. So we've got this protection thingy, which we're gonna put the potato on. Oh, I've never. <laughs> <laughs> so we've got this protection. Oh no, you're ruining the potato. <laughs> but this is actually working, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Ah. Ah. Here. Oh. So these will be our chips. They're really wet. What do you want to season it with? I feel like I need a lot of flavor in there. We all know why. Season the shit out of it. Salt, salt, salt. Pommes gewürz. Burger. Little bit of garlic. And only a bit of rosemary. Now let's stir, stir, so stir. stir. Okay, so by now you would have eaten an entire bag of chips. Maybe Bad. that's the healthy part about it. You'll take so long making them that you just don't eat them. This is the sex smile children are making when they're told they should smile naturally. <laughs> Ameisen scheiße. Which means? No, you gotta tell them. This is a part of our German culture. And poo. And we say it to make children smile in pictures. Yeah. Amazon scheiße. Or spaghetti. Which means spaghetti. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Okay, let's place this in the microwave. So we're just gonna leave them in there for four minutes and hope and pray. And... Oh? Oh. <laughs> they look like chips. Really? They're not crispy though. <laughs> not following the instructions anymore. Wow, can't wait to eat though. Mmm, delicious. Cheers. They needed more time in there. I think they look great now. I don't know what's wrong with this one. They do look like chips. They totally do. Mine's with peel. Oh, mine's really spicy. Or burned, I'm not sure. These are good! They don't taste like potato. They are amazing! Give me more! Huh? 
And you will literally only eat 20 chips because you won't do that again. Mm -hmm. And now we ate them all, so I guess they're good. <laughs> now drink to that. Yeah, yeah, I need to go to bed. Yeah, but this is the end of the video. This is done. This is diddly doodly so over full. with. I'm full. Oh, I'm Thank you so much uh, for letting me try. Let me know if you guys want me to try any more gadgets. Maybe name the gadgets. If there are specific gadgets you want me to try. Apart from that, I just want to thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. It's really nice of you. And Taco really loves you for watching this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Y nos vemos la próxima vez. Y bye. Thanks. <laughs>